It was a large fire, smoke visible for miles. And it took Ankeny and Polk City firefighters over two hours to put it out. The roof collapsed down, so our firefighters are having a hard time getting to the actual fire itself. Just happened to be there at the right time and right place, so um, ended up being a good thing. Brian Honnold is a realtor at Iowa Realty. He was driving by when he saw the smoke, then the fire, then the vehicles parked outside the two-story storage garage. Something just said there's this isn't a, uh, a good situation, something's not right. His gut was right. After calling 911, he knocked on a locked door and two dogs appeared. Then, while Honnold was searching for something to break out the door window to save the dogs. All of a sudden, a young man came out. And he's like, you know, what's going on? What's go what, are you, what are you doing here? Why are you stopped here at the, you know, and he kind of was like, it's on fire. What are you, you know, what are you talking about? After Honnold convinced the boy there really was a fire, they had walked about 25 yards from the garage that firefighters say had multiple vehicles inside when something exploded. It was big enough that we both felt it and we're like, oh my, uh, oh, you know, oh my goodness. And uh, we, we, I said, we need, we need to get out of here. Within minutes, the garage was engulfed, its contents heavily damaged, but no injuries, possibly due in large part to a man driving by who decided to stop instead of just calling 911. I am just really glad everybody's okay.